Adrian Brussels is a bit like an iceberg. It's really, really cool, <laughs> but actually you can't see most of it. And the bits that you can't see are the member organizations. You can't see the vision that we talked about today of the people back in 2002 who could see all of this coming, who understood what opportunities there were and what threats there were. You don't see the, the amazing expertise among our members that allow us in Brussels to, to do our job and to make it seem like we're the important ones. You don't see the, the passion driving national organizations and achieving absolutely unbelievable things. You don't see the, the stamina of groups that have no funds, that have no support, that, that believe and that push and that make things happen that are impossible. That's what Edry is. Um, I uh, love the fact that I was sitting in the visible bit of the iceberg and that I got tons of credit for stuff that I didn't do. Um, <laughs> that's what Brussels is all about and why they <laughs> And for heaven's sake, why the hell shouldn't I? It's my turn. I've been here for 22 years. <laughs> <laughs> but there's, there's one person uh, who actually embodies the vision, the expertise, the passion, and the stamina, and the public service in the background um, more than anybody else. And that is our president of the past 10 years. So. Um, on behalf of the iceberg, the cool, the cool bits and the less cool bits, I'd like to take the opportunity to uh, thank Andreas Krisch for <laughs> for managing to do all of the things that he does, and beneath the um, the water line, somehow managing not to drown uh, in the process. So there is a box somewhere, Andreas. So, thank you. <laughs> and. And uh, and with that, I end the formal part of the evening, and you can now eat, drink, be merry, and be, as all of our uh, network is, terribly, terribly cool. <laughs>